Nearly a week after the lives of two Barhaven area residents were lost, a growing memorial has been started. Just before midnight on Easter Monday, emergency responders were called to the corner of Merrillville and Viewmount Drive across from Merrillville High School. Upon arrival, a man and a woman, both in their 50s, were found to be in cardiac arrest inside their car, which had hit a hydro pole after being T-boned by another vehicle. They were transported to the Ottawa Hospital Trauma Center by ambulance, where they succumbed to their injuries. On April 5th, Ottawa Police charged Shin Shun Lang, the 19-year-old involved in the crash, and a foreign exchange student from China studying at Carleton University, with two counts of criminal negligence causing death, one count of careless driving, and one count of stunt driving. The victims were identified by CTV Ottawa as 49-year-old Dora Aspland, a nurse at the Ottawa Hospital, and her husband, 54-year-old Brian Aspland, a former CTV video editor. They leave behind a teenage son, Matt, 19, and daughter, Caitlin, 17. Auto police confirmed that the Asplund's Toyota Corolla was driving on Merrillville Road when a collision with a BMW occurred. Police add that it is still unclear what caused the collision. Driving conditions do not appear to be a factor as roads were bare and dry at the time of the incident. A growing memorial has been started at the scene of the crash and students from St. Pius High School, the school where the Asplund children attend, have been going and laying flowers and wreaths. Charlie Senak, TWIN News, Ottawa.